What's up, YouTube? Just wanted to give you guys a short review of the eShops PSK 100 Hang Over the Back Protein Skimmer. I've had this protein skimmer for about six months, and it seems like the longer I have it, the more and more efficient it becomes. So I know there is issues with uh, breaking periods on most skimmers, and uh, a lot of people get discouraged and disappointed within the first few weeks uh, if they're not producing good skimmate. But as you can see, mine is working perfectly fine. If I open the collection cup, it's nasty inside there. You would not want to stick your nose inside there. Uh, little specs on this thing. It's got a four inch collection cup, which is great compared to most uh, over the back uh, protein skimmers. They usually have a very small cup and you'd have to dump it out almost every other day or every day because it gets full. Nice thing about this cup too, it also has a strain or a drain that you can plug into something else to help with the overflow if it ever gets filled up. Um, this thing's about seven inches wide and about 23 inches long. It's got the PSK pump at the bottom. It's a needle wheel. Pumps uh, directly into the body of the skimmer. So if I can get you a good shot, you can see the bubbles coming out. Um, it gets the water through here, comes up and over, goes down to the pump, comes back up the body, and then comes back on this return line. This return line, um, this here where you see the white dot, you can adjust it. The further you push the white dot back, the more you open this, and the water level inside here will drop. When you bring this white dot to the front, the water level in here will start to raise. Now the higher you have the water level, you know, the less likely you are to collect this dark skin mate. So what I like to do is I like to leave it just at about this line and you get this nice dark nasty stuff. But um, you know I just reading all the reviews on this thing and I just couldn't believe what I was reading because this thing's been working so great for me. Um, only cons that I didn't like was this piece here sitting on the frame it actually vibrated a lot so I stuck this plastic hose under it got rid of the vibration I did the same thing for the bottom as you can see right here I cut a plastic hose in half so that the blue part wouldn't touch the back of my tank and reduce more vibration and besides that the skimmer is actually really quiet the only thing I don't like now is that since I put these lights here, these radions, I've been getting a lot of uh, growth on the outside of my skimmer. Um, really not bad growth, it's Coraline, but you know it's, it's starting to look ugly after time. But Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. This is the PSK 100 over the back, and I would definitely recommend this skimmer. It'll keep your stuff alive. Happy reefing.